Hey everyone, it's finally here. My Pioneer VSX832 AV receiver. Got it from Amazon last night. Just getting a chance to unpack it today. This looks like there's a little damage here at the corner. It doesn't look bad, superficial. The thing has got DTSX, DTS PlayFi, HDMI, Dolby Vision Pass-Through, Dolby Atmos, sort of. It has only 5.1 channel output, so Dolby Atmos is a little funny on here. Uh, Wi-Fi, Pandora, and a bunch of other stuff that is uh, blocked by my address. It has 4K HDR pass-through. I don't have a 4K TV yet, but I will one day, so I wanted to be prepared for the future. Uh, we've got some more stuff down here. Spotify, Chromecast, has four HDMI entries and one output. So let's get this thing cracked open and uh, see what's inside. So inside right away we have, looks like the antenna, we have the microphone, which will be used to uh, configure the surround sound properly for your listening experience. Got the remote control. It looks like that's about it, except for the receiver, which I'm going to pull out. There it is. The Pioneer VSX 832. Looks beautiful. Those knobs feel great. Nice and clicky on the input selector. Nice bit of resistance on the volume. Those buttons feel really nice. So let's see, we got headphone jack, we got the microphone jack for the uh, MCACC setup. Got USB and, a, oh, ooh, an auxiliary input. For those who, I guess, don't have Bluetooth still. Back here, we got coaxial, coaxial uh, assignable CD, optical, this digital audio in. All right, so we got the network, an additional USB that could be used, I guess, for upgrading or playing MP3s or FLAC or whatever files you might have. Got some old school video inputs, won't be using those. Some old school audio inputs, won't be using those. And we got four HDMI, which is more than enough for me. Uh, all HDCP 2.2. And we got an ARC HDMI out. Perfect. 5.1 speakers. And uh, looks like we got some Wi Fi satellite antennas. All right, so. Let's get this baby uh, hooked up. We'll be back. All right, here we go. We're all plugged in. All the speakers have been set up. I got front left, center, front right. I got the subwoofer in the back over here. I know it should be in the front, but it's in the back, so deal with it. I got rear surround right and rear surround left. So we should be good to go. Let's give it a go. Ooh. So we are in the initial. 
initial setup. See TV. I see the TV. So I'm going to select English here. Welcome to initial setup. Have you connected all the speakers and devices? Before starting, please connect speakers and sources. Now, would you like to start initial setup? Yes. Do the full auto macaque. Do it now. All right, so I'm gonna plug in the microphone. We'll be right back. All right, so I got the microphone on my Jerry rigged uh, tripod here, ear level. So let's plug you in. All right, so let's see what we got here. Should probably step out of the way so it can measure properly. So we got speaker channels, 5.1. Well, let's see what other options there are. 2.12, no. 3.12, 2.1, 3.1, 4.1, 1. 5.1, subwoofer, yes. All right, so enter. Okay. the output from the subwoofer. If sounds connected, detect check of subwoofer to turn on and adjust to. So I hear the I hear the subwoofer a little bit. I'm gonna be right back while I adjust it. All right, I got the subwoofer rumbling. So let's continue. Please place each please place setup microphone at center of listening area at ear height. Each speaker generates test tones at high volume levels during measurement. Keep quiet. All right, so we're gonna keep quiet while this does its thing. Speaker detect. Yep, I mean, I heard them all. Looks like it's thinking. Subwoofer, small, small, small. I mean, yeah, I mean, they're small speakers, so I guess that's right. Uh, I'll just take it for what it says right now and adjust later. Save. Please unplug setup microphone, okay. This step, this step will start to check if the connections were made correctly. Would you like to continue? Yeah, sure. 
what selector do you want to check? Let's check, uh, let's check my PlayStation first. Is picture and sound right, which you wish to connect? Uh, I mean, I should turn it on, huh? Let's see if that does anything. It's not really proper English. It's picture and sound right, which you wish to connect. I guess it just means, am I getting picture and sound? Well, I'm definitely getting picture. Once the menu loads up in a sec, we'll find out if we get sound. I hear sound. Yeah, so if I... Seems correct to me. So picture and sound is correct. Do you wish to check other selectors? Yeah. Let's check my uh, stream box, which is the Apple TV. So just turn on the Apple TV. Doop, doop, doop. So that seems correct to me as well. I'll of course adjust the internal settings in a little while, but yes, I'm done checking because that's all I got is my PlayStation and my Apple TV. Do you want to ch connect network connection? I did plug in an ethernet cable to my uh, modem, so it should work. So let's hit yes, we're wired. Connect, yes. All right, successfully connected, perfect. Uh, sure, accept, accept. Good, Chromecast, won't use that, accept. Audio return channel, uh, unfortunately I don't have a TV with ARC, uh, but I don't need it because I'm not using an antenna. This step would enable TV to send audio to if you receive through HDMI, yeah, so skip that. Please enjoy your theater experience. All right, so that's it. Let's see what we got here. Got all the speakers. I'm sure I'll learn what all this stuff means, but there it is. That's the setup. That's the unboxing of the Pioneer VSX uh, 832. Thank you for watching.